I celebrate myself and sing myself and what I assume you shall assume. For every atom belonging to me as good belongs to you. My name is Justin Rigamonti, and I teach here at Portland Community College. I teach uh, three writing classes, and I also teach poetry. I've been teaching here for about five years. The kind of teaching that I strive for is the kind that's reacting to the world, reacting to the students in my classroom. I, I don't plan everything out ahead of time. I have a general framework that I work within, but then things happen organically. In my classroom, I definitely do see changes in the students from the beginning of the term to the end of the term. They start off at the beginning of the term thinking of argument as something that they engage in by bringing their, their perspective and ramming it against everybody else. And by the end of the term, my goal is that they, they see academic argument as something that they can come and join with um, mutual respect for everybody else that's there, with empathy for other people's positions. It can transform somebody's life, um, that class. It can change somebody from this inward arguer with defensive walls all around them to somebody who sees hotly debated issues in our country as something that they can objectively and empathetically engage in with, with their friends and neighbors and family members who they disagree with. What draws me to the genre of poetry, I think I would say it's the way that it expresses epiphany. Poetry goes for the moment. Poetry tries to capture the moment of self-awareness. The moment of heartbreak, or the moment of, of wonder. That's just how I experience the world. Those are the landmarks of my existence, those moments. And I don't see my life in a linear way. I see that as these, these lights in a field, and the moments are those lights. And so poetry is the medium that I can use to, um, uh, to chase after that. Poetry Press Week is a nonprofit organization that a friend of mine and I co-founded in 2013. Its mission is to change the way that poetry is perceived, presented to the public, and published. We modeled Poetry Press Week after Fashion Week. Instead of having models come down the runway, poets present their um, new work through readers, through video. And instead of having buyers of clothing in the audience, we have editors and publishers. Having poetry delivered to the public in this way changes the way they perceive it. Being a writer is about being in your body and, and just letting yourself experience human existence and be honest about it. Recently, a, a favorite word of mine uh, is a bit of a downer word uh, when I say it, but, but to me it's, it's full of so much hope. And that word is meaninglessness. That things can just be what they are. They don't have to mean something. And if you let go of that idea of meaning, of pointing away from a thing, then you just get to be in the moment. The moment doesn't have to point away from itself. You just get to be in it. And I, you know, my shoulders drop and I, and I just say, what is the meaning of life? Right here. It's just being right here.